Hey guys, what's up? It's Lucy T and we are live on the scene and it is your lucky day, TGIF, because I am here with celebrity manicurist Tracy Lee. Hi everyone. And you can follow Tracy Lee on Instagram. Yep. Lux by Tracy Lee. Lux by Tracy Lee. And if you want to follow any of my pug and pizza adventures, you can follow oh me <laughs> at Lucy T NYC. So we are going to be doing the cosmic nail. And please mm -hmm. leave all of your comments, questions below. Mm -hmm. um, my nails are already prepped. She's going to do one of my hands, and then I'm going to do one of hers. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned through the whole video because watching me try to do this nail art is going to be pretty weird. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to do great. <laughs> so I'm a righty, so she's going to be doing my left hand. So first we're starting with a blue base because the sky's blue. And is this the first time you're doing this cosmic nail? No, I've done many cosmic nails before. Um, from black to blue to pink, all different. There's so many different ways to do this type of nail look. Um, and it's it's really a lot of fun and it's super easy. You're gonna see how easy it is when you do mine. <laughs> and how long have you been doing these gorgeous manicures for? Um, well, I've been doing nails for over 20 years. Um, so it's been it's been a minute. Thank you for the encouragement, Rachel. I really appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see how that goes. <laughs> and um, what are some of like your favorite like what brands are we using here? Well, today we're using the base color is this beautiful color by Dior. It's called Darling Blue. Ooh. And so for this, I'm just going to do um, one coat for this. Okay. Just because it'll dry faster. So next we're going to use um, Morgan Taylor. This is their, their white nail polish. And we're gonna start with this because this is gonna create our, our galaxy, our cosmic path okay. for the nail. So what I'd like to do is I, I like to take the nail polish and put it on a little tray. And then we're gonna take a makeup sponge like this. Oh my gosh. And I'm gonna dip it into the, the color, dab it. And then we're just going to gently place it on the nail where we want our our lines to be our cosmic lines, if you will. Okay, first of all, that is beautiful, but also <laughs> this is really intimidating me. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be fun. It's just a little sponge. <laughs> I do have those at home, so I could try this at yeah, home too. <laughs> just a little sponge. And if you get some on the skin, just wipe it off, nice and easy. And we're just going, and we're going to vary the placement of the sponge as well. So each narrow nail will be unique. Yes, exactly. Thank you, Carolyn. She loves the blue. I do too. It's so I'm good. Really excited. It's really, uh, it's really highly pigmented. It really gives a beautiful sheen. And what are some tips for people that are going to try to do this at home? Slash for me in like five minutes. <laughs> you know what? I say just have fun with it. You know, this is it's nail polish. You could always take it off. Yeah. You know, start from scratch. It's nice and easy. And do you have any tips for doing like your opposite hand? Because I feel like sometimes I can do my left hand, mm -hmm. but then when it comes time to doing my right hand, it's yeah. like a mess. Well, I think that even for me, it's a little difficult too, the same. Yeah. So I just think doing the opposite hand first, the harder hand is easier. So because what happens is, is when you, um, when you start with your um, dominant hand, Yeah. Now your your non-dominant hand is wet. So if you do the opposite, your dominant hand is, you have more control, it's wet, but you're okay with it because it's dominant. Does that make sense? Yes. That's why she's the expert, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot wait. I'm gonna like make weekend plans just so I can show off my manicure, but I might have to hide hide my other hand after I attempt oh, to do it later no. <laughs> at my house. Telling you, you'll see. It's gonna be easy. I'll take you. I'll take okay. you through it step by step. Okay, good. So what this white base is gonna do too? It's going to pop the other colors we're gonna add on top of it. For some contrast. Right, because we're gonna use some lighter colors on top, a lighter blue, Ooh. which is gonna be next. So this way, the white acts as a base. Gotcha. Right, because this won't show up as much on top of a dark color. So we're going back to the glass plate. Right, back to the glass plate. And I like the glass plate because you can um, clean it easily. It's nice and easy. 
Then you feel fancy. Then you feel fancy. Because <laughs> we're fancy. We are fancy. So now we're just going back and we're going to blend. Oh. Blend the white fancy. and the dark blue together with the medium blue. Like so. Oh gosh. What do you think? Is it starting to look yes. cosmic? I don't know if you guys can see, but Tracy <laughs> Lee is a serious artiste. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello. I will have some champagne, please. <laughs> <laughs> With my cosmic With nails. With my cosmic nails. Yeah, so we're just putting the medium blue on now and on the sides of the of the white part and we're blending it into the dark blue. So pretty. White. Have you done this cosmic nail on any celebrities? No. Sadly, no. <laughs> I haven't. So this is like a real exclusive, guys. It is an exclusive. <laughs> Most of my celebrity clients, um, you know, they like to do simplified. If they do art at all, it's very yeah. simplified. Gotcha. Like a Swarovski crystal or something, you know. Thank you, Rachel, for commenting. Uh, Rachel says that it's great to hear about doing the heart, the um, hearty first. So you're off the other hand. Yes. Thank you. You go, girl. <laughs> Thanks, Rachel. Thanks, Rach. It is a good tip, isn't it? I always wonder that. I'm like, there has to be a secret to this because I cannot be the only one who mm -hmm. is like you're physically not. incapable of doing my own nails at home. <laughs> nope, you're not. Have you ever painted any dog's nails? Um, besides my own, no. What color do you paint your dog's nails? Um, well, my new dog, I have a new puppy, <gasps> and I haven't I haven't painted hers yet, but my old dog I've done blue. Oh, what kind yeah. of dogs do you have? Um, I have a Boxer Lab. Boxer She's Lab? She's adorable. Oh yeah. my gosh. So, I don't know if you guys can see. Here, let's show them this gorgeous, incredible art that you're doing, JC. So you can see there's like the dark blue base and then we did the white sponge mm -hmm. with a little bit of this blue here. Right. And this is like only the beginning, guys. Just the beginning. Okay. So now I'm using a tweezer to pick up the sponge just because it's easier to control the sponge with the tweezer. And it's such a small little um, piece that I'm using, I break it apart. So now I'm just putting, I'm blending the darker blue just a little bit more so it doesn't look so specific on the nail, the other colors. And we're just blending it all together. And you know what? There's no right or wrong in this. It kind of, sometimes it just develops um, as you're doing it. And you're like, oh, I think I could use a little bit more there or a little less here. Yeah. And you just keep layering it until you're happy with it. Oh my gosh, I love it. I'm so excited. Love it already? Yes. We're not even... We haven't even started yeah. with like... Like there is a paintbrush here, people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So Carolyn asked... Well, first of all, she said looks good. Thank you. Thanks, Carolyn. Thank you goes to her, actually. Thanks, girl. <laughs> um, and her question is, do you always start with the dark first or can you do light first and then dark? Well, I think it depends um, if you're doing this combination. Um, I would say dark first, but I guess why not try it? You could see how it works out, but if you're going for that real cosmic right now, we're going for, since it's autumnal, we're going for the deeper vibe. But if you wanted to do lighter first, like um, I've done some in the spring and summer yeah. where it was a white base. Ooh. Um, right, and we blended in some uh, pinks and blues, you know, and oranges into that to make a really cool cosmic effect. So I, I say just go for it and see what works for you and how it looks. You don't nice. like it, you take it off. That's good too for like a beach vacation. Right. Mm. It's only been two days of fall weather here and I'm already waiting for summer. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we're never happy here in New York. Mm -mm. So now we're just more blending and blending. See, you can see this though, right? Come on. We'll find out. <laughs> um, so we have a question coming in. Uh, what are some popular nail trends that you are loving? Right now, yes. um, the trend of the moment is chrome manicures. Everyone's going nuts for... What does that mean? Well, a chrome manicure is applied with makeup pigments. 
so what we're doing now is we're applying nail polish in different colors and makeup pigments come in different metallic sheens and it's just a powder and so you take it and you rub it onto um, the nail color and it comes up beautiful mirror chrome oh holographic gosh. we call them unicorn nails it's unicorn fun. nails I like that yeah it's fun so yeah so that's the hottest trend right now have you been doing a lot of those nails? a lot yes so now all I'm doing now is I'm going back with the white and just highlighting just the center. Thank you, Sean, for complimenting my ring. <laughs> <laughs> my husband is a lucky man. <laughs> and that was my husband who just said that. <laughs> so thanks, babe, for watching. Oh, you need to help so me cute. do this at home with the pug. <laughs> I, I hope he's watching very Taking closely. Notes. <laughs> Take notes. He's doing your other hand. Exactly. So here is another look at these gorgeous, gorgeous nails. This hand's like, right? But Let's hide that one under hide the table. Hide that one. It does not match. <laughs> so you can see we're like doing some serious, serious blending with mm -hmm. the blue and the white. Um, I don't know if you guys can see, but we have this glass plate here, and um, she's like literally blending the mm -hmm. colors like. Right. Monet. Monet. I like it. So. Mm. <laughs> Very lucky girl here. More Monet. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Beautiful. So if you're just joining us, we are live on the scene and we're here with celebrity manicurist Tracy Lee and we're doing the cosmic nail. We are. And so the way that it works is she is going to do a phenomenal piece of art on my left hand. And then I'm going to attempt to do one of her hands. So right. trying to pay attention. So please leave any encouragement below or <laughs> any questions for Tracy Lee um, because she is like serious queen of nails here. And happy Friday. Yes. What's everyone doing this weekend? What are you doing this weekend? Um, I don't know. Probably working on my house. I'm renovating my house. Oh. So yeah, that's what I'll be doing. So now, guys, I'm taking Six. my little detailer brush and some white polish, and I'm just going to make little tiny little dots all over the nail in different areas. It's just going to give us more dimension. Hey, Cheyenne. How's it going? Thanks for tuning in. So you see we're oh just my gosh. sporadically just placing small little tiny polka dots. Do you see this, Cheyenne? It's just going to look like little stars on the nail. And where can you get a brush like this? Is this just repurposing like an eyeshadow brush? No, this is this brush is made specifically for nails and it will be on the market soon. Okay. Um, it's not yet, but... Um, so this is like a real exclusive here today. Yeah, right, exactly. <laughs> So, but no, you can get nail art brushes at any arts and crafts store. Awesome. So Cheyenne's also asking um, and letting us know that we can do what everyone, okay, I'm sorry. It's Friday, guys. I have serious Friday brain. Thank you for the encouragement. I can do anything I put my mind to. That's right. <laughs> and you can too. We all can. Yeah. We all can. Practice, practice, practice. So what's been your favorite, like, nail trend over the years? Um, favorite nail trend? I just love that it evolves, to be honest with you. I'm not, um, you know, once I try something and do something, I'm over it. I'm on to the next. Yeah. You know? Um, so I just love how the nail industry has evolved in over 20 years that I've been doing it. It's just it's really fun. It's really fun. I mean, I'm having a lot of fun. I hope you guys are having fun mm -hmm. with us, too, because... Nails. Right. I mean, <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay, so now now that we have our dots on the on the nail, our little stars, we're going to. I just see so a little something I want to fix right now. So how did you get your start doing manicures? I started when I was a teenager. Um, I was obsessed with doing my own nails, and I was the, I was always interested in. Um, and uh, I was always creative, so I used to draw and paint and things like that in school. And uh, when I started doing my own nails, I was like, oh, 
the nail art boom back then wasn't even anything what it is now. <laughs> You know, so I just, you know, and they didn't have the products available, so I kind of just winged it with, you know, paint at the arts and crafts store and brushes wow. and things. And um, I just became obsessed, and I would spend hours, three hours, doing nail art on my nails and then take it off two days later and redo it again. You know, wow. it was like that kind of obsession. And it still continues today. I just, I still love it after all these years. Do you think techno like technology and how the world is so connected has sort of helped influence the fact that there's Absolutely. so many Absolutely. Well, you know what? These the brands today they now they have now made nail art accessible. Back when I started, you could you had to get it done in a salon. You know, they didn't have the products available like they do today in retail outlets. So um, I think that yeah, so that and the brands and helping and social media helping um, people being able to take that that now the br the brands available to them mm -hmm. the products available and create their own DIY and post it and you know gain tons of following. Yeah, I think, I think it's amazing. And There's, tune into the scenes Facebook Live to learn yep, how to do this. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to be using this is my new favorite bling for it's the holidays. It's a very pretty bottle. It's um it's by Dior. It's Dior's new um holiday collection. It's called Nova. But guys, I mean, if you could see the, all the beautiful prismatic wow. colors in here, can you see it? Yeah, holographic. So this is going to give us our twinkle. And we're just going to place it sporadically within our galaxy section. You see oh how that's gosh. now changing that? It's yes. making it sparkly. <laughs> I, I, wow. Yeah. This is amazing. Hey, you could do this. Come on. We'll find out soon enough. A couple of steps. <laughs> Here, let's show all the viewers easy. how this Nova is like just making this it's manicure so good like a supernova a supernova <laughs> yeah that is some serious nails so you like getting your nails done how often do you get your nails done? oh my gosh i get my nails done probably once a week oh that's great i like do all you, my do lunch you love break nail art? <laughs> do you like nail art this is the first time i've been I've had the chance to do any nail art. Oh, awesome. So you're like I'm breaking my nail art cherry here. <gasps> Ooh, I like that. <laughs> That's so funny that you said that because I always say that. I'm like, I'm so glad I picked your <laughs> nail art cherry. <laughs> so she's done with the iridescent Nova. Mm -hmm. Yep. And now I'm just going to add just a little because, you know, the sky is in three, two dimensional in the night. So this, um, this color by KB Shimmer, it is called Turning Point. And what I Ooh. love about it is it still has that holographic, but it has just a tint of pink to it. Oh. So I think we're just gonna add just a little bit here and there, just a touch. And you know, if you saw what I just did, if, if you feel like you're putting it on too heavy in spots, you can just dab it with your finger and take it right off. So just gonna give it just a little bit, see? Wow. So at home, do you have like a gorgeous area of your bathroom just dedicated to nails? And I have nail an entire station? room. Oh my gosh. I have a beauty room in my house. Yes. Oh my gosh! Mm -hmm. If my husband's still watching, wish list. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want a beauty room. <laughs> you deserve it. Come on. So we're just adding little dots of pink here oh and there. Oh my gosh! And this is just like an accent. This is just a little. Highlight of the nail. Highlight on the like, blue, on yeah. On the blue, yeah. Just to make it a little more interesting. Oh my gosh. And now we're going to top coat you. So this is like it, guys. <laughs> and then we'll do the top coat, and then and the top coat. And now you're gonna see it really pop. And then I will paint Tracy's hands, basically. <laughs> All right. Oh my gosh. And it's really like dried as we've been putting on the different layers. Exactly. So. The polish, because we're using it on the plate and getting such a small amount, mm -hmm. it's almost like the consistency of, um, of paint. So it dries really quick. So I think when I was like 10, I attempted to do some nail art. Like, remember there was those um, Schultz books? I don't know if anyone watching used to mm -hmm. do those, where you like make your own chapstick or you do your own nails. And, um, and I remember doing, like attempting to do them and just getting like a swirl mush of color because the nail polish on the bottom wasn't dry and I was like with the brush trying to fix it and it was mm -hmm. just like a big old mess. Yep. 
I like those Schultz books. I wish I invented that. I know. That's genius. <laughs> right? Yes. What's genius is these nails, Tracy Lee. Thanks, girl. <laughs> Look at that. I mean. <laughs> That's it. You're done. I can't. Voila. All right. Are you ready now, Tracy Lee? I'm ready. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay. I'll walk you through it. Okay. Baby steps. Okay. So. So we're going to do this hand. Beautiful, like, mini rings, by the way. Thanks, catbird. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I hope we you have some nail polish remover for later. I have lots. No worries. Do we need to do a base coat or anything? It's already prepped, girl. Oh my gosh, look at you. Okay, and should we start with the pinky? Yep. Okay. Start with the pinky. And is there like a, a method to like dabbing it the perfect amount yeah. without it? No. I usually like to take off one side, one side of the polish. Oh, good. All right. So I'm so sorry. First one done. Thank you, Carolyn, for the <laughs> shout out. I've done a pinky so far. You know what? Actually, mm -hmm. I think the nail art part will be art part will be mm -hmm. a lot easier. It's like the bra like mm -hmm. getting the base. I think that's so. If you want, it's easier. Yeah, to hold the nail straight. There you go. Done. You know these um, these brushes have a rounded edge, so it kind of does the work for you. Okay. And should I like dip it back in every time? Yeah. Okay. Until you cover the, the nail. Until you're happy with the coverage. I don't want to give you like a glob. It's okay. Should I redo this one? Just hit the okay. side. Just hit the sides a little. You missed. <laughs> I missed a spot already. Just a little bit down the side. Oops. That's and now okay. I <laughs> we'll take care of that. Don't worry. Here, you want to show them your manicure so far? Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's some some polish on the cuticle. Sorry That's about that. Right. That's nothing. That's easily fixed. Oh my god! You realize like trying to do your nails is like like singing to <laughs> Kelly Clarkson or Simon Cowell. <laughs> 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 uh, so, um, so what other colors are like really great for fall? Well, you know what I'm loving now? Shades of brown. I'm so into Ooh. all different caramels and chocolate. Um, I love uh, Sand Tropez. Sand Tropez. That's like one of my yeah, favorite it's like colors. A, that's like a beige right, kind yes. of color? Yeah, that's pretty. I'm so yeah, so that's really what I'm into. I'm digging it. And I, I've been wanting a chocolate brown moment in nails for a while. Yeah. So I'm glad it's finally here. Do you have any like nail art designs in mind to like capitalize on this chocolate brown trend? Um, well, I just, I just posted one, um, on my Instagram, my Nail Streets Instagram, and, uh, that was fun. I'd used, um, beige with some swirls of brown up the nails, so that was kind of simple and cute. Ooh. I liked it. Are you doing any, like, cool nails for the holidays? Um, probably. I usually do. You're gonna need a little more polish for that big thumb. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's okay. You're doing great. You're getting nail polish all over her fingers. We can clean it up after. Okay. Okay. So if you're just joining us, we are live on the scene here with celebrity manicurist Tracy <laughs> Lee, and we are doing the cosmic nail. She did my hand, which obviously is beautiful and amazing and fabulous <laughs> and out of this world, mm -hmm. literally. Literally. See what I did Good there? One. <laughs> Manicure high five. <laughs> and so now I'm attempting to do the same gorgeous nail art on her hand. Mm -hmm. This is the start. Um, so please leave any comments or questions below for Tracy and Lee and any words of encouragement. <laughs> I think that would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> So um, we are going to move it along. Yeah. So, so what's the next step here? Now you're going to put some white on the on the palette here. And I'm going to give you this. And you're going to grab one of the little sponges. And you're just going to dab the white in two okay. different spots on the nail. With the tweezers, right? Yep. The surgery. Okay. And is there a method to this? Or? No, just two little small spots on the nail. 
this is going to create our base. So do like one little spot. Try using just the tip of the sponge. Oh, okay. Instead of the whole, yeah. You want just, just the, yeah, exactly. Yeah, perfect. Okay. You're doing good. You're doing good. Thank <laughs> you, Tracy. Lee. You've got this. Oh, okay. Thank you. Help you out a little. Contributing to your own manicure. Yes. <laughs> I am a team player. Thank you. Okay. So try doing a little on this corner on and that corner. corner. Okay. And then do a little bit by the cuticle. Right. Exactly. Perfect. So now we're going to take okay. our blue and we're going to hold on to that sponge and you're going to do the same thing with the blue. Okay. Over the same spots? On the side of the white, because we're kind of, we don't want to cover the white, but you want to kind of blend it in with the with the blue, so it's going to give gotcha. your, your cosmic nail some dimension. Great. Yep. Okay. So do it on either side of the white. Right. Good. <gasps> You're doing it! <laughs> it looks sort of okay. Okay, we're gonna go back and add some white <laughs> anyway in the end. You're doing great. Thank you, Tracy Lou. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> I'm gonna follow you on Instagram. Do it. I'm gonna like. I have I have two nails. Instagrams. I have my Lux by Tracy Lee is basically my editorial work. Mm -hmm. I'm a little bit of personal in there, and then I have Nail Streaks with a Z. Ooh. Which that's kind of my new my new my new found toy. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so what's the next step? So now we're going to oh. Here's my nail. Here's what it should look like. Right. But she's doing a great job. Come on. I mean, it looks same, same. Same Z's. Same Z's, right? Okay, so now we're going to take the blue again. We're okay. just going to blend it just a tad. Okay, with more sponges? More sponges. Okay. And you're going to do the same thing, but on the on the side of the blue you just put on. So okay. we're going to blend the so it's dark. like a, bl a blue nail polish, white nail polish sandwich. Can you tell I'm really hungry? <laughs> I don't know, girl. This might be your side hustle. It might be. This this is my side hustle. <laughs> I'm just glad I'm not eating jelly beans. Yes. Okay. Almost there. You're doing it. You're doing it. You're doing it. Wow. I have like Eye of the Tiger playing in my head right now. <laughs> Blending, we're getting some dimension. Some dimension and one last hit of okay. the white. Should I do a new sponge or? Yep, okay. do a new sponge. And then we're going to, yep, exactly. You're just gonna barely just, just highlight the, the white area already in that trim. Good, we're just gonna pop it a little bit more. Good. Ooh, look how fast you're just going now, girl. <laughs> we need a little bit more white. Good job. And now we put on the Nova. The Nova. You've been dying to put on the Nova. I've been dying to just hold this bottle. Look right? at this bottle, you guys. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Not like it's Christian Dior or anything. No. Okay. So you know. And so we'll just do a little layer of this, right? Yeah, you're just going to highlight just the white a little bit. Just a little bit. Yep. Exactly. Good. Okay. Grab a little more, a little, a little more glitz. You might need to like check your bags because I might steal that, Tracy. Yeah, no. <laughs> no. Maybe I'll ask my friends over at Dior to send you one. <laughs> Do you hear that, friends at Dior? Mm -hmm. <laughs> we have it on tape. We have it on tape, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I might give my address, so don't right? push me. <laughs> okay, so last but not least. Okay, the pink. So now, here we go. We got our sparkles happening. Okay, All so right. now just, just, just a couple cool. dots okay. of pink. Alrighty. Oh, oh, that was a big dot. Oops. It's okay. Remember what I taught you? Oh, yeah. We just can go like it. that and just dab it okay. away. Okay. Voila. Okay, just a little dot. Just a little dot on the side. Good. 
<laughs> She's laughing at me. I'm going, <laughs> Sorry. You're doing a great job. We're not laughing. We're learning. Although exactly. I am learning. Good. Good. Do you want me to dab it at all? Yep. Okay. I'll do it for okay. you. Okay. I'll help you out. Okay, so All now right. one last step. We forgot oh, the dots. Oh, I forgot this. Okay. We have to do our little polka dots okay. for our stars. Okay, so then just do a couple of dots on each nail. When you said for the stars, I just had like a vision. Perfect. Remembering Paris Hilton's song. What was it? The stars are ours or something? Yeah. I don't know. I was listening to the Throwback Thursday playlist earlier. Oh. Almost done. She's doing a great job, guys. Thank you. Considering. <laughs> Considering. We're, pop we're popping two cherries today. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and now, the base coat. Top coat. Okay, I can't F this up, so. <laughs> Look. We got our dots, our glitter, our okay. Nova. And now this is gonna make it pop. Ooh. That definitely made your right. pinky pop. Bam! <laughs> Cause it's Friday, Friday, gotta get down on Friday. <laughs> oh, Rebecca Black. Oops. I did a little too much top coat with my excitement for singing Rebecca Black. Okay. 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 So, how'd you do? I don't know, you tell me, Tracy Lee. <laughs> I think for your first time, you my did first time, darn I didn't good. do so bad. Obviously, you can mm -hmm. tell this one is the beautiful <laughs> one that Tracy Lee, celebrity manicurist, did herself. And then this was my attempt. Um, I'm sure she'll be taking it off in like five minutes. <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you for my one handed manicure, Tracy Lee. It was fun. Thank and, you. Um, Follow us on Instagram at LucyTNYC and Lux by Tracy Lee and Nail Streets with a Z. Yeah. <laughs> Happy Friday, guys. Thank Bye. you. Bye.